pass with them back to my channel. Yeah, I'm a bad bitch. You can't kill me. I just want to let y'all know that this video is not supposed to be messy or no drama is supposed to come to this video. Um, I just want to make a story time, honestly. I really don't care. But y'all, consistency with me because this story time is really good indeed. So, yeah. So, I'm going to give y'all a story time while eating mine. Real simple. Let me make a, um, what you call it, really good. So, I made this like shout out to her and I got my frozen lemonade I don't know y'all don't mind the background I really don't care I'm just really hungry so you finna talk about yes I'm on a shoe box I'm be done but in my first month band I'm finna do another story time I hope y'all be watching my story time let me tell you fan though so, we talk about my fake best friend. Don't mind the noise in the background either. Ooh. But, my best friend, best friend. We was best friends for like, since we were three years old. So that's like 14 years. We was best friends for 14 years, like my closest friend. Like, me and her, like, ever since we were little, we all a little far apart. I don't know why but we did go to the same schools but she always used to go she's always move a lot but she still went to the same school so we barely got to see each other not like never but like we see each other like i don't know like five times a year <laughs> and then it dumbed down to like two times a year one times a year so we never seen each other like that but we was always best friends like our loyalty was like we best friends like everybody knows my best friend so this happened like in june so i went to her house it was just here i went on her house and i was like i had to see my best friend like, i haven't seen her in a long time like this pandemic and stuff and she live far away now like she lives so far away from my house now and she be living in that house for a minute. I be living in this house for a minute. And it was always far. And our parents always work. Like they always work. So we never time. Never got the time to see each other. Like our parents never drop each other off. This and that. To your house because far away. So I found I had went got me an Uber. Went over there. Guess how much it cost? Sixty dollars for Uber. It was a 30. I don't know. It was high. I never spent that much on Uber before. So, I'm gonna go see her. First of all, we had so much fun. And the second day, we had went to a party. And then, the third time, we had went to another party too. And her friend had died or whatever. Sorry, RIP to him, but he passed away. At, at the party and the party that i had went to okay the party was my cousin party and my cousin went to her school and they was real close and me and him was real close well so i don't know that boy do too much but we all went to his party and so the, everybody at his school was their school they knew the boy because they went to their school he went to their school everybody was like dang when they had found out the new everybody like dang like the vibe was like a little off then everybody just start partying, having a good time. Like, it was like a sad moment and then everybody just got happy. Start vibing again. That night, like one thing about me and my best friend, like that's not my best friend, quiet. me and her, we always make videos like does smash, TikToks, trailers. We always do that every time we see each other. That's like the best friend. Yeah. So that night, after the party, we was making TikToks and stuff. And then all of a sudden her vibe just went like, Ooh. I was like, I don't like this. Like me, I'm the type of person who like to have fun. Like I like to have some fun. Plus, 
we barely get to see each other. So let's not make the best of it. I was over there for like a good five days. <laughs> but like we barely get to see each other. Why are you so upset? So and then I don't know. I don't know what's for her. Like she always do that. But me and her, we always fall out and be back cool. We only fell out like a couple of times. Probably like a good five times. Probably like a good five times after 14 years. So the next day, we slept down there and stuff. The next day, we were just watching YouTube videos, stuff like that. And that day went by fast. I don't know why, like, that day, we just sat in the house all day. Like me, I like to go out. Corona or not, I like to go out. So we just chilling and then the next day, Oh, that night, let me tell y'all. That night, she was on the phone with her friend. And me, you know me. I be going to sleep, like, I be going to sleep, like, at one or two. I do not stay up past three, but like, I be going to sleep. And she, on the other hand, she like to stay up all night and be sleep all day. So, fast forward, that night, the next night, I should say, she was up to, like, I don't know, bro, like, six o'clock in the morning she did not go to sleep that whole night and so i was sleep and she was just up laughing giggling like laughing mad loud all that i was like, i'm tired and her, i even heard her on the phone her, her friend was like bro i'm sleepy go to bed like, i'm trying to get some sleep i'm trying to clear up my acne go to sleep okay so if it wasn't doing nothing i was sleep ready to go home yeah, I'm not sweet. I was ready to go home. <laughs> but I don't want to overstay my welcome either. Like, I know we best friends are. But I know you're like, when you going home? Like, everybody want me like that. When you go home? When your company going home? I don't want to overstay my welcome. So my card wasn't working for my Uber for some reason. I don't know why, but it wasn't working at all. And so I called my that door that day when she was asleep. She would sleep all day. We didn't even do nothing. Like, I just hate laying in the bed. Like, I want to get up and do something while I... Especially if it's not my house. I don't want to sleep, sleep in nobody's bed all day. Like, I hope that's nobody. Like, I don't want to sleep in nobody's bed all day. Let me eat my corn. Because, baby. Bye. So, I called my parent. I was like, yeah, pick me up because my car not working. I'm ready to go home. <laughs> and then... I don't know. She was just mad. Like, we didn't talk that whole day. You was asleep. I was asleep. Like, I just got so much things going on that I wanted to do in life that I was doing on my computer. So, we didn't talk to each other that whole day. Like, she even made her breakfast. Every time I was over there, she always offered me for breakfast. And, or she always cooked me something. And stuff like that. It got made breakfast by herself. <laughs> I knew something was up when she didn't ever put up breakfast. She made her some breakfast and walk. We always say good morning to each other, so that but And she didn't say nothing to me, so I already knew something was up. I just said that. So I called my folks and was like, y'all picked me up and stuff like that. So my parents finally pulled up. Like, let me tell y'all. She didn't even say hey to my parents. She didn't even go out the door. She just looked and stuff. I think she helped me with my bags. I don't know. It was just, the vibe was just so off. She didn't say bye or nothing. But I've turned around from the day, bye, the door's already shut. I was like, dang. Hey, what did I do? So I got home, and my friend, she, her folks live across the street from me, like literally across the street from me. And she was like, hey, I'm at my folks' house. You wanna come outside? You Can I come inside? And I haven't seen my friend in a long time. So we made a TikTok and I posted on my spam. Mind you, let me tell y'all. So my best friend, she had a spam. She disabled it. She was like, I'm not gonna enable it. So I don't want to. I'm like, that. So all of a sudden, when I posted it, when I post yeah, I had posted me and my friend TikTok. I was like, I miss my friend so much. Some 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 some. Just saying stuff, I do miss my friend. So all of a sudden, I see I got an extra follower on my spam. I'm like, who is you? So I look 
and it was her spam in April. I was like, dang, I thought Sue said she was gonna able her spam no more. But oh well, I wasn't like thinking about it. So, she watched my whole story. And so, as soon as I clicked on her page, it's her using that sound, something like that. So she blocked me. I'm like, what she blocked me for? So let me fast forward you to this. I'm gonna call her Fran. Fran A. I'm gonna call her Fran A. Me and Fran A both go to the same school. And then like my cousin, like I said, that go to my ex best friend school, who party went to, that was her boyfriend at the time. And so I introduced Fran A to my ex best friend. And then we start being real close. Like before this party and stuff, like we all had a group chat. We always used a group FaceTime. We always did a lot of stuff. We ain't never, they ain't never see each other person to the party, but we like social media friends basically. And my friend, hey, I had in, introduced her to my best friend. They barely even knew each other for like, I don't know, five months, barely five months like knew each other like that barely three months i'm gonna say that yeah i barely three months so they barely knew each other that was like first time meeting in person Ooh. Mm. and my best friend i'm just gonna keep on calling her best friend because i don't feel like keep on saying it's best friend but my friend and hey, my best friend they both follow each other's spams like we always follow each other just follow each other's spams and stuff and how my friend was still on her spam for a good minute. And then the next day later, let me just tell y'all that. So the next day later, mm, she texted me. My ex said, huh? She texted me talking about some, um, you're fake, shady, something like that. I'm gonna send y'all a text. I was like, not send y'all a text. I'm gonna screenshot it for y'all. I was like, what? Like in my head, I was in the car with my mom and I told her when I was texting her. And she was like, y'all gonna be best, y'all gonna be back cool again. Let me tell you why I'm not back cool with y'all. So she texted something to my um friend A and she was like, ew, what is this? Uh-uh. So she had texted my friend A. She was talking about, she was talking mad shit about Talking about some, she, some, I forgot who she had. I'm just making a mess. But I forgot what she said. She was just going on. All I knew was that she was like, I wasn't there for her when her friend died. When I told y'all her friend had died, we was at the party. She was like, I wasn't there for her. I just felt like sad and stuff. And she wasn't there for me to vent to. Fire for it. Wait, rewind that. We rewind that. Mind you, she was on the phone. He he and ha ha ha. <coughs> Bro, for like all night long. But you talking about some. I wasn't there for you. Something like that. Girl, you wasn't even crying. I never seen a tear drop on your face by that. Don't even go there with me because I ain't stupid. That's one thing. So, I had one on my Twitter. She unfollowed me. My main parents don't follow me. I'm like, damn, what's the heat? What's the pressure? You're just telling me. You didn't even tell me nothing. Like, and me, one thing about me, I don't want to be in no sad mood all day. Like, somebody say, I'm going to hype them up. Something like that. Like, don't be in your feelings all day. Like, I don't like none of that stuff. I don't like none of that negative energy. Keep it part. And then, me and Frank A him went to the mall. Like, a couple of days after that. And then she had made a boom on me and her. So, me, so my ex friend still follow friend A. So we had made a boomerang and she replied to the story to my son, ew, look at her, something like that. I'm like, damn, what is the pressure? What's the heat? Let me know. Friend A told my son, girl, stop being mean, something like that. Like, what you being mean for? We were just cool 24 hours. Not 24 hours ago, but we were best friend 14 years. And you talk about you talk to this girl behind my bed that you barely knew for three years. What type of mess is that? You don't even know her. You don't even know her last name. Like, come on, man. On Twitter, I still she ain't bought me on Twitter though. I I think she bought me on a number. One thing about me, I'm not gonna kiss nobody ass. 
I don't care who you are. Trust and believe that. I don't care who you are. I'm not freaking nobody. Uh, what is it? August? So like Ju July? Yeah, it gotta be July. Friend, hey, she's talking about some. My um, ex best friend had unfollowed her because we all used to post each other on our pages. And like, I was even thinking about who finna see the page. We were like, we just having fun, so let internet see, whatever. She was like, she don't follow her, all that. Oh my God, I hate that bitch. And you know it's funny? Mm -hmm. So my friend, I was like, who I seen that day across from the street from me, we had made the TikToks. She was like, she follow my best friend, follow her on Twitter. And this just happened like a couple of days ago, or like two weeks ago or something like that. And then my friend, I'm gonna call her friend B. My friend B, she was like, she don't follow her too. I was dead, bruh. Cause she had posted me on her, on her Twitter page and she don't follow her cause she seen me. I was dead, I'm like, what type of person is that? I will gonna be back cool with her. Cause we always have our ups and downs. But after, she talked about him behind my back to a girl she barely know who I introduced her to. That just blew it, baby. And then she would pay the artist a liminal post on Twitter too. I was like, dang. But yeah, that's how we fell off. I ain't, I ain't, uh, -uh. I can't be, with, I can't be friends with that. Mm -mm. And she an Aries. She all, she stay on her feelings. But I was always that person to be right there by her. Okay. I grew up from all that. I think God did that on purpose. Just to, you know, separate people from my life. I love it. Keep on doing what you do. But don't kill nobody. Come on. Wish death on nobody. But that was my story time, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And peace out, Barb.